from the 4th of January 2020. Some small changes are being introduced to the instructions and layout of the paper-based listening test. The paper-based test will now be divided into parts 1, 2, 3, 4. This is a new IELTS listening test format test. We will be removing the part 1 example. We are also removing the page number references. Part 1. You'll hear a man calling a catering company. First you have some time to look at questions 1 to 5. You should answer the questions as you listen, because you will not hear the recording a second time. Listen carefully and answer questions 1 to 5. Hello, 5 Star Caterers. Can I help you? Oh yes, I spoke to you an hour ago about the arrangements for our end of term party. Oh, that's right. It's Mr. Saunders, isn't it? Actually, it's Sanders. That's S-A-N-D-E-R-S. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll just get that down correctly on the form. Okay, Mr. Sanders. Sorry about that. No problem. Well, I've got the details you asked for, so I thought I should call you back quickly and book. Good. Let's fill in the form, shall we? Great. First of all, can you give me a telephone number? Somewhere where you can be contacted during the day. Yes, it's 445-6786. 445-6786. Okay. And do you have a number where you can be contacted outside of office hours? Well, I'm at work till late in the evening, so use the same number. And if I'm not there, you can leave a message. Thanks. I'll make a note of that. And how many guests shall I put down? Okay, that's changed. So instead of the figure I gave you before of 85, it's now only 50. It's much lower, I'm afraid, because a lot of people can't make that date. That's not a problem. Can you remind me of the date we'd set? Yes, it's the 25th of June. Okay, that's fine. Before you hear the rest of the conversation, you have some time to look at questions 6 to 10. Now listen and answer questions 6 to 10. Now, did you have the chance to look at the tables on the website? Yes, I did. And I think the rectangular tables would be good. The long, thin ones. Yes, um, you can have two of those. The only problem is that they are for 24 people. So, you'd only seat 48 people that way. And if you have 50 guests... Oh, I see what you mean. Two people have nowhere to sit. What about the square ones? You'd have the same problem with numbers. Usually, for 50 people, we find the round tables work well. Not the smaller ones. They only seat 6 people. The ones that seat 10, the large ones. So do you think we should have 5 of those? I think that would work well. Okay. That's what we'll do then. Fine. And have you decided on the menu you would like? Yes, I think so. But I wanted to ask you, we talked about having the three-course meal with waiter service, but in the end, we thought it would be a bit too formal. So that leaves the buffet or the seven-course banquet. How much is the banquet again? A hundred pounds a head. That's too much and too formal. The buffet is fine. Okay, so I think I've got everything. We'd need a deposit of 50% of the total. Right. What's the total? Just a minute. Yes, it's 30 pounds a head times 50, so that's 1,500 pounds. 50% of that would be 750 now, with the balance due another 750 on the day. Great. I'll call in tomorrow if that's okay. I can pay you the deposit then. We'll look forward to seeing you tomorrow then. Okay. Thanks a lot. Goodbye. 
Goodbye. That is the end of part one. You now have half a minute to check your answers.